Good morning, everyone. It is your concierge, Luke Lario. I wanted to give you guys just a little bit of information about me, about um, what my role for you is. Um, I'm 23, I am married. We, my wife and I just bought a house. We're loving life. Uh, we volunteer at our church every weekend. We love it. We're really, uh, really passionate about um, our faith and we love being a part of the church and getting to be a part of something bigger than us, getting to impact a lot of people, uh, which is similar to what I do with the core, obviously. Um, if you're new to the core or if you're new to level three, I want to make sure you know what my role for you is, which is as your concierge, I am going to be your eyes and ears at the core. I'm going to be your your lifeline. Um, anything that you need, if you're struggling with knowing how to fill out a form or you've got a question about something or you've just got some new tactics you're trying to implement and you want some help with that, I'm your go-to. So give me a call, shoot me an email, say, hey Luke, uh, I'm thinking about implementing a daily team meeting. I don't really do that or I just want to get, I want to make that a little better. So can you send me some material on that? And I'll send you some audios, some forms, some examples of things that other people do. I'll hook you up. So don't forget about me, use me, I am an asset. So don't forget, <clears throat> um, this year we're doing something a little bit different. We're trying to make a bigger push to really support you guys even better. And we wanna make sure that you guys get the best support possible at the core. You guys are so important to us. We wanna make sure you're getting taken care of. So the All About You form is a big way we do that. So I know a lot of you guys have been in the core for a while. You filled out an all about you form when you first joined, but it may have been a while since you updated it. Maybe you got married. Maybe you had a kid. Maybe you found a new restaurant that you liked um, in the past year or two. So maybe it's just time to update that form. So if you've had any big life changes or any little preference changes, you know, if you think that your all about you form might be a little bit outdated, just let me know. Say, hey Luke, I would like to update my all about you form. I'll send you a new form. You can fill that out, take 30 seconds. Um, and then we, we make sure that we don't lose track of just building that relationship with each other. We don't forget about each other. We, you know, I'm just, I want to make sure that I'm giving you guys the best experience you can possibly get at the core. So definitely let me know if you want to update that form. I'll send it right to you. We just read The Go-Giver. Rick assigned it to all of us employees at the core. Um, a lot of coaches were assigning it at the end of the semester, last semester. Um, my biggest takeaway from that, I just wanted to share with you guys, because um, it really impacted me and I just, maybe you'll get something out of it. Uh, but I I was really impacted by the way that each and every character that uh, Joe, the main character, got to talk to about their businesses, about what made them successful, was uh, everyone that he talked to was massively successful, but every single one of them was extremely humble. They didn't let it go to their heads. They didn't think, oh, I'm the biggest and the baddest and you know, I I worked my butt off to get here and everyone needs to do what I say and I'm the king. And no, everyone, you wouldn't have known they were some super successful tycoon unless they had told you. They didn't carry themselves any differently. They didn't flaunt themselves or their money or their success. And that really inspired me because even, not that I'm some huge tycoon, but even at, you know, at 23 and and you know buying a house and it's easy to get prideful when you feel like oh I'm so much farther along than most people my age and that's so not true I just I want to make sure that I'm checking my heart every day to make sure that I'm not coming across as being above someone else or feeling like I've got it all together because I don't I mess up every single day um, so just staying humble really impacted me and the fact that each one of those characters was able to do that even though they were hugely successful and i know each and every one of you is hugely successful right where you are and you'll get more successful each and every one of you has the potential to go beyond what you can imagine and in your success and you'll get better and you'll see that this semester at the core that you're going to improve you're going to hit bigger numbers you're going to be better get better do bigger things and i just want to uh, remind you guys just to remember who you are and all that. Don't lose yourself in the chase. Don't lose yourself in the glitz and the glam and blah, blah, blah. Each and every one of you is awesome. Don't forget it. I'm super excited to work with all of you. Give me a call. I'd love to get to know you more if we haven't talked already. But I'll be seeing you guys at this 
Summit in May. Um, don't forget, the Mega is coming up in August. Send your people if you want to go. Make sure you're getting people to the Mega. We can't wait to pour into them. Have a great week, guys. I'll talk to you soon.